hungry. But you know what sounds really good? Pizza. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Taryn Echo here, representing TLE Fitness Coaching again with another food challenge. So today we are here out in Los Angeles. It took me an hour and 15 minutes to get here because I live in the Mission Viejo area. And I'm excited for this one. My friend Reyna set up this challenge. It's pretty much 30 individual pizzas. It's called Papia's Bakery and Cafe out here in Glendale. Anyway, so this bakery set up this challenge with Reyna. And what it is, is it's 30 of their pizza style breads of some sort. It's about seven pounds roughly. So I'm thinking we're gonna get a good win here. If I win, I get 500 bucks, a great way to pay my gym rent. Also, if you wanna follow me a little bit more on my fitness coaching, TLE Fitness Coaching on Instagram, also follow my personal page for all the food challenges, Taryn Eckel. Let's get this challenge started. Okay, I so thought I'd show you guys this on the inside. Homer Simpson, getting ready to do battle. Okay guys, here it is, the official challenge. Right now, I have about 50 minutes to do this. If I don't finish, I have to pay for each individual one. If I do finish, I get $500. So, this challenge has some stakes at it. Right. Yep, and we're gonna start it off in three, two, one, and go. go. Hey guys, so I thought for this challenge I would do a voiceover to let you know how I was doing and everything. As you can see, I started off feeling really confident about this one. I wasn't really worried about it, so I didn't bring my usual liquids. I was only drinking this Propel drink I had, a sparkling carbonated drink, and um, I think that's all I remember drinking during this challenge. But these little pizzas had like meat on them, no cheese, and it was just this bread. The food in the beginning was really good actually. I really enjoyed everything I was eating during the beginning. I ate, I believe it was 12 of them in less than 10 minutes. So I was going really quickly. I wanted to just get it done and enjoy the rest of the day pretty much. But I guess there was a reversal of fortune where I, was going a little too quickly and underestimated the amount of salt that was in this challenge and also the fact that these things were very chewy. The crust was unbearably chewy. I would, after eating 12 or 15 of these, I started to lock up where my jaw would just lock up with a bunch of food and I could not swallow it anymore. Even when I was drinking liquid, it would not go down. So it would be chewing on one piece for almost three minutes and then trying to get the next piece down. After a while, the challenge just became a battle to keep everything down. As you can see right now, I'm still doing really well, but stay tuned and keep watching. You'll notice how much harder it gets.
see right now they were kind enough here at this bakery to offer me a little dessert this is really really good Natilla style one of their specialties here the owner made it himself so I highly recommend you come out to Papoyan Bakery out here in LA they have four locations now I believe the owner was telling me and these are really good way to finish up the challenge. Thanks guys again for staying tuned for the video. Follow me at both my main Instagram, Tara Neckle, and my business, TLE Fitness Coaching, if you want fitness tips, help with nutrition. Also, if you're looking to train with me, tlefitnesscoaching.com. Thanks guys.